It was four shots. Bang, 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 bang. And then I uh, heard four more. Chester Stagg says he was in bed just before 1 a.m. when he heard his neighbor, 19-year-old Cruz Abel, being shot to death. And I heard a girl screaming and yelling. Stagg says it's not uncommon to hear shots in this troubled West Sacramento neighborhood. They call this the wild, wild west. Helen, who didn't want to use her last name, brought balloons and crosses. She says she was at the store when she heard the fatal shots and saw Abel running. He was reportedly shot while walking on Merkley Avenue, then again as he ran back towards his driveway. You know, just to see anybody running for their life and then getting killed like that, and he's a young guy at that. Here, white picket fences and well-manicured lawns are blighted by remnants of crime tape, bullet casings, and obvious signs of the wrong kind of foot traffic. West Sac is forgotten. This tight-knit area with generations of extended family has been hit hard. It affects the whole community. It's family ties. My mom been here, my grandpa been here, my on both sides, you know what I'm saying? Tease says you need look no further than the prostitution and drug use on West Capitol. Across from it, Merkley right here, you know, uh, all, you, all they got to do is walk 100 feet this way. Martinez and Tees see progress elsewhere. With the with the building on the on the um, river walk and all that extra stuff, they don't care about what's going on. They care and they want change. Their neighbor is dead and they're having to deal with it. They still live here and the shooting suspect is still on the loose.